This is George again from East Coast Computer Services. If your external hard drive seems to not be accessible anymore and you can't open up any of your, your photos, your hundreds of photos that you have saved on here, all may not be lost. You do have a backup, don't you? Well, if you don't, we might still be able to access them. I'll show you how. Hey, before we proceed, we want to make sure that we tried some preliminaries like another USB cable and try plugging into a different USB port and also trying a, a different making sure the AC adapter is working. Assuming that you've tried all that and still not getting anywhere we're going to take the hard drive out of its case. Now this is a pretty simple one. There's four screws here and two screws here on the bottom. Sometimes you have to uh, peel off a label to expose the screws. Uh, other times there's like a plastic plate. But anyway, we'll take these screws out. Keep in mind that if your drive is still under warranty, opening it up will void it. However, the warranty is not worth a whole lot if you cannot um, I'm gonna say the you can't get a hold of your pictures and once you send it back for warranty service they're probably just gonna give you a new hard drive and you're gonna lose all your stuff so we're gonna um, we're gonna open this up here remove these two here Okay, there's two more screws right in here. And out we go. I want to take note of the interface of your hard drive. This is a serial ATA or SATA. Um, there are two common standards. It's PATA or IDE or serial ATA. Now we're encountering a couple more screws. Actually three more. Interesting there's only three instead of four. We're going to simply slide it out. It is possible that the circuit board is bad and that's why um, the computer is not recognizing the hard drive. So, we have here another hard drive enclosure. And they sell these at any uh, computer shop. They have them in two different uh, interface types, which would be IDA or IDE rather, or serial ATA. Once we have the cover off, we're going to slide this right in here.
taking note where they get connected. This is your plug. Needs to line right up there. Okay, slide them in. And then we put the lid back on. Now we're going to go check it out and see if it worked. Alright, I'm going to give it a go. I'm plugging in and turning it on. And it looks good. Everything is here. The hard drive wasn't the problem, it was the enclosure itself. Now just keep in mind that once you open it up, you're going to void any warranty that, that you have. However, the warranty is not going to cover your photos, your hundreds of photos you may have stored on there. So, um, this is your only hope to recover your data outside of sending it to a data recovery company. But if the hard drive is accessible, uh, you'll be able to get your stuff. So, I hope this was helpful, and if you have any questions about this or anything else, give me an email at info at eastcoastcomputerservices.com. Thank you for watching.